for entrance exam uh, remember if uh, a is a diagonal matrix then a inverse equal to only take the x instead of x 1 upon x instead of y 1 upon y instead of z 1 upon z means uh, reverse the number only you get the inverse of diagonal matrix again we discuss very interesting problem a equal to given matrix 1 2 3 4 and uh, capital x is 2 by 2 matrix such that given condition is a into x equal to i and find x so we start the solution for given condition we start with a given condition a into x equal to i so given a into x equal to i a is equal to i therefore x equal to what this uh, a goes to the right hand side become a inverse become a inverse into this identity matrix i but uh, i consider this i identity matrix means so consider one identity means one or unit matrix or unit means one so one into a inverse a inverse so capital x equal to a inverse so we want to find x means so we want to find a inverse so we can find the a inverse of uh, this uh, given matrix a by using by using inverse method or uh, adjoint method also we use the row transformation method but uh, always uh, we use the adjoint method because uh, this method is very easy okay so what is the uh, formula for a inverse by adjoint method so formula is a inverse equal to 1 upon determinant of a into adjoint of a so what condition on this uh, determinant a condition is determinant a is, is uh, not equal to zero if uh, determinant is a uh, zero then what happen 1 upon zero infinity any number upon zero always in infinity so zero into this uh, adjoint means uh, infinity into this uh, adjoint is infinity and therefore uh, a inverse not exist and therefore condition is that determinant a is not equal to zero determinant a is not equal to zero so first we find the determinant of a so therefore determinant of a equal to what is our a we take the determinant of this uh, matrix a so determinant of matrix first row 1 2 second row 3 4 and what is the determinant this is a 2 by 2 determinant two Ro rows and uh, two columns and therefore this uh, number 1 into number 4 1 into 4 4 Minus this uh, number two into this number three, two into three, six, four minus six equal to minus two, and uh, therefore determinant a is not equal to zero, and therefore a inverse exists. A inverse exists. Again we. Find the adjoint of a. So here given matrix A. For the adjoint of a, there are three steps. First step is uh, we want to find the minor of given matrix. Second, uh, we want to find cofactors of given matrix. And last, uh, we want to find transpose of cofactor matrix means adjoint of A. So first we find. minor of 
माइनर ऑफ मैट्रिक्स ए इक्वल टू सो व्हाट इज द माइनर माइनर इज नथिंग बट माइनर ऑफ नंबर इज द डिटर्मिनेंट ऑप्टेंड बाय डिलीटिंग रो एंड कॉलम पासिंग थ्रू दैट नंबर सो व्हाट इज द माइनर ऑफ दिस नंबर वन डिलीट रो एंड कॉलम पासिंग थ्रू दैट नंबर एंड टेक द डिटर्मिनेंट ऑफ रिमेनिंग नंबर इज व्हाट रिमेनिंग नंबर फोर सो डिटर्मिनेंट ऑफ फोर वॉट अगेन फोर अगेन डिटर्मिनेंट ऑफ दिस माइनर वी वॉन्ट टू फाइंड माइनर ऑफ दिस टू सो डिलीट रो डिलीट कॉलम वॉट रिमेनिंग थ्री डिटर्मिनेंट ऑफ थ्री वॉट that number itself that number itself because uh, determinant of uh, first order determinant expansion of first order determinant means that number itself so what is the minor of this three so delete row and column passing through this number three so what remaining two determinant of two itself two what is the minor of now last number four delete row and column passing through this uh, number so what remaining one determinant of one itself what one so this is our minor matrix of matrix a we want to find a cofactor matrix so co factor or uh, cofactors of A only what? What is cofactors of A? Here is a four, three, two, one, and uh, this is a two by two matrix. So what our idea? Diagonal numbers are no change, no change. Only here is a change, change by sign. So what happen? Four, one, as it is, only change by sign. Means uh, here is a plus three. So we do. Minus three. Here is a plus two, so we take minus two. So this is a cofactor of given matrix A. So what is adjoint? Adjoint of A equal to adjoint of A equal to transpose of this cofactor matrix of A. So first row four minus three. Second row minus two one, and uh, it's a transpose. Transpose means convert the row into column. Convert the row into column. So first row become first column. So first column is four minus three. Second row become second column. so second column is minus 2 and 1 so this is our adjoint of a by putting this value of adjoint of a in the formula we get a inverse equal to 1 upon determinant a what is determinant a minus 2 so 1 upon determinant a is minus 2 into adjoint of a what is adjoint of a this is a matrix so 4 minus 2 and last row minus 3 1 3 1 1 3 find the a inverse of a given matrix and we finish this uh, problem so we enjoy also more problems we enjoy all more problems on the matrices so this is also very interesting uh, problem find matrix capital x such that ax equal to b where a and b is given so we start the solution so here is a what given condition find matrix x such that such that 
एक्स इक्वल टू बी ए इंटू एक्स इक्वल टू बी सो गिवन कंडीशन इज एक्स इक्वल टू बी एक्स इक्वल टू बी देर फॉर वॉट एक्स एक्स इक्वल टू दिस ए गोज टू द राइट हैंड साइड बिकम ए इनवर्स बिकम ए इनवर्स ए इनवर्स इन टू दिस बी एज इट इज सो फॉर फाइंडिंग कैपिटल एक्स we want to find a inverse because uh, in our hand b as it is here is a b but uh, we want to find this a inverse for finding a inverse what is the procedure we use the method of adjoint method we use the adjoint method for uh, adjoint method what is the formula for adjoint method what is the formula so formula is a inverse equal to 1 upon determinant a into adjoint of a adjoint of a here is a what condition determinant a is not equal to 0 determinant a is not equal to Two. So first we find the determinant of a given matrix A. So therefore, determinant A equal to. So we find the determinant of this uh, matrix. So determinant notation is two vertical bar. So first row one, two. Second row minus one three. and uh, this is a 2 by 2 row second order determinant this is first row second row this is first column second column so how expand this this first number 1 into this uh, number 3 we take a cross multiplication 1 into 3 3 minus 2 into Minus one means uh, again minus two. Two into minus one means minus two. And minus minus plus three plus two. Three plus two. So what is the value of three plus two? Equal to five. Equal to five. What is the main step? Five, which is not equal to zero. Which is not equal to zero. and uh, therefore therefore a inverse exist a inverse exist after that uh, we find the adjoint of a so three steps uh, required for finding adjoint of a first step finding the minor of matrix second finding the cofactors of matrix and last transpose of transpose of cofactor matrix means uh, adjoint of a so first we find the minor matrix so minor so minor of matrix a equal to minor of matrix a equal to Minor of matrix A equal to means uh, minor of numbers of given matrix A. So how minor is find? So here is a given matrix A. Minor is is nothing but determinant obtained by deleting column and row passing through that number. So here uh, one we delete row. And column passing through this uh, number one, so what remaining? Three. So we take the determinant of three. Determinant of three means uh, three is a uh, determinant of three is the first order determinant. So first order determinant is expand by its uh, number itself. So 
determinant of 3 is itself 3. Again, minor of 2 what? Row, column, delete. What remaining? Minus 1. Determinant of minus 1 itself. Determinant of minus 1 itself. Next, what is the minor of minus 1? So, row, column, delete. So, what remaining? 2. So, what is the determinant of 2? Again, uh, 2 itself. Minor of 3. So, delete row and column passing through this number 3. What remaining? 1. So, determinant of 1 itself 1. So, this is our minor of matrix A. We find also cofactors of uh, matrix A. Means, cofactors of cofactors of A equal to what? What is the cofactors? This is a 2 by 2 matrix. For 2 by 2 matrix, what is the idea? For finding the cofactors, no change, no change. And here is the, this is diagonal numbers, no change in the diagonal numbers and uh, change in the diagonal numbers by only sign. So, 3, 1, as it is, this uh, minus 1 become plus 1 and this uh, 2 become minus 2. So, what is cofactors of A? 3, 1, minus 2 and 1. So, therefore, Adjoint of A. What is adjoint of A? Adjoint of A. What is adjoint of A? Adjoint of A is a nothing but transpose of cofactors of A. Means uh, this is the this matrix is the cofactors of A, and we take the transpose of this matrix. So three, one, and this minus two, one. Minus 2, 1. It's a transpose. Equal to. Transpose means what? Transpose means row converted into column. So, first row 3, 1 converted into first column 3, 1. Second row converted into second column. So, what? Minus 2, 1. This is a adjoint of A. Adjoint of A and therefore therefore by putting this value of adjoint of A and uh, value of uh, determinant A equal to 5 in the formula in this formula we give the number 1 to this formula and uh, we find the A inverse. So therefore A inverse equal to 1 1 upon determinant A, determinant A is here phi u, so 1 upon phi u into adjoint of A, what is the adjoint of A, here is a 3, first row 3 minus 2, second row 1, 1, so this is a A inverse, we have completed the first problem. Also, we discuss the second problem. Very interesting. What problem? A and B is a given. And verify. A B inverse equal to B inverse, B inverse into A inverse. So, we discuss the second problem. So, solution start with uh, LHS. What is our LHS? LHS is a B inverse. LHS is A B inverse. So, how the A B inverse uh, prepare? This is a A, this is a B, A into B. So, first we find A into B and then find its a inverse. Then find its a inverse. So, equal to as it is. So, 
we write uh, for a the matrix a what is the matrix a 2 3 1 2 2 3 1 2 1 2 into b b means this matrix 1 0 second row 3 1 first row 1 0 second row 3 1 a into b this and it's a inverse it's inverse so how can I find the product of two matrix so simple idea first row first column sum of product of corresponding numbers first row first column so sum of product of corresponding numbers of rows and columns so we take first row first column so 2 into 1 2 sum means plus first row first column 2 into 1 2 plus 3 into 3 9 so first row first column finish again use first row second column pahla row prepare karne ke liye pahla row all columns aisa use karna hai so 2 into 0 0 plus 3 into 1 3 again second row first column second row prepare karne ke liye second row first column second row second column but uh, place to place multiplication lena hai aur baad mein sum means uh, this is first number of second row and this is the first number of first column so 1 into 1 1 plus 2 is the second number of second row and uh, 3 is the second number of first column so 2 into 3 6 so here is a first row first column finish again first row second column similarly first number of second row into first number of second column so 1 into 0 0 plus 2 into 2 is the second number of second row and uh, 1 is the second number of second column so 2 into 1 2 so multiplication take place place to place but uh, with uh, addition with addition it's a uh, inverse as it is equal to what 2 plus 9 11 0 plus 3 3 1 plus 6 7 and uh, 0 plus 2 2 it's a uh, inverse so we find the uh, also inverse of this uh, matrix then complete our LHS complete our LHS यहाँ पे आप A inverse हमने निकाला है और हमें find करना है capital X equal to A inverse into B so we put the value of the A inverse in this place so what we get capital X equal to what is A inverse this uh, matrix so 1 upon 5 matrix 3 minus 2 second row 1 1 into B into B what is B here is a B is a matrix 0 1 2 4 so first row 0 1 second row 2 4 so what is the multiplication of uh, two matrices sometimes what happen some students uh, make the multiplication of this uh, matrix by this number 
and then I take the multiplication with uh, this matrix. This is also correct, but uh, complications will be made, and so that to avoid complications, this number keep at it as it is, and uh, this number multiply lastly. So equal to one upon five. How multiplication? Sum of multiplications of uh, rows and columns place to place. So first row, first column. For prepare first row, first row, first column, and uh, first row, second column. So place to place means three into zero, zero plus minus two into two, minus four. First row, second column, three into one, three plus minus two into four, minus eight. So first row prepare again same by the second row we prepare the second row. So second row, first column and second row. Second column. So we take the multiplication of uh, second row with uh, two columns, place to place. Two into this uh, one into zero, zero plus one into two, two. Second row, second column, one into one, one plus one into Four, four, so equal to what? One up upon five as it is. Zero plus minus four means a zero minus four. Zero minus four is minus four. Three minus eight what? Three minus eight means uh, make the subtraction of eight and three. So values five and give the sign of largest. Uh, Number means a minus, so three minus eight minus five, zero plus two, two, and uh, one plus four, five. So lastly, multiply this number to all numbers of this matrix. So what we get? Minus four into one upon five, minus four upon five. No more spending your energy and money on coaching classes or missing classes for rain, for rally, and any other nonsense. Subjects covered by multiple teachers with repeat telecasts. Doubts, concepts, applications, no problem. All explained through great and significant animation. So sit back comfortably in your home and watch Study Spectrum TV channel. So we discuss a very interesting problem. This is because A is given and B is given, and verify A B is inverse equal to B inverse into into A inverse. So solving this problem, first we find the A into B, and then we take the inverse of this A into B. So what solution? A into B is inverse. So LH we take LHS equal to A into B inverse. A into B is inverse. So first we find the A into B and then take uh, its inverse. So this is uh, our A. This is our uh, matrix B. So we put uh, these two matrices at this place. So equal to In the curly bracket, A is a matrix. First row two three, second row one two into the this matrix B means first row one zero, second row three one, 
and it's a inverse it's inverse so we multiply this uh, two matrix place to place multiply and then uh, take sum so equal to what how multiplication first row first column so 2 into 1 2 plus this 3 into 1 this 3 into 3 3 into 3 9 so finish the first row first column again first row second column what 2 into 0 0 plus this uh, 3 into 1 3 3 into 1 3 again same for uh, second row so second row first column second row second column so 1 into this uh, 1 1 plus this uh, 2 into this 3 2 into 3 6 again uh, second row second column so 1 into 0 0 plus 2 into 1 2 and it's a inverse so here is a inverse equal to what this 2 plus 9 11 0 plus 3 3 1 plus 6 7 and uh, 0 plus 2 2 it's a inverse how can find the inverse of this matrix also by using adjoint method so what is the formula for a inverse by adjoint method a inverse equal to 1 upon determinant of a into adjoint of a always uh, box the formula or uh, given the number to the formula so we give the one but uh, condition what determinant a is uh, not equal to zero determinant a is not equal to zero so we check first determinant so determinant of a equal to what determinant of determinant of a means uh, determinant of this actually matrix so determinant of 11 3 11 3 second row 7 2 7 2 equal to what how find the determinant so this 11 into 2 so this is a 2 by 2 determinant second order determinant so we take cross multiplication so 11 into 2 22 minus 3 into 7 21 equal to 1 and uh, this is not equal to 0 this is not equal to 0 and therefore a inverse exists and therefore inverse of this uh, matrix is uh, exist again we find the adjoint of a of uh, this uh, matrix so for uh, adjoint there are three steps we find the minor of matrix a means uh, this matrix we find the cofactors of uh, this matrix and lastly adjoint of this matrix so co first we find minor so minor of minor matrix equal to what for this uh, matrix minor of matrix equal to what minor of matrix equal to so we find the all minors of this uh, number okay so how minor minor is the determinant obtained by deleting row and column 
passing through that number. So here is a L one. So row and delete column. Column and row delete. So what remaining two? So determinant of two itself two. So this is two. Again a minor of three half. So row column delete. So what remaining seven. So determinant of seven itself seven. What is the minor of seven? Row column row delete. So what remaining three. So determinant of three. Itself and uh, minor of two means uh, row column delete. So eleven determinant of eleven itself. So this is a uh, minor of uh, this uh, matrix. Again uh, we find the cofactors of this uh, matrix. So cofactor of matrix equal to Co-factor of matrix equal to what is the meaning of co-factors? Co-factors means this is a two by two matrix. So use a simple idea. No change, no change, change by sign, change by sign. So diagonal as it is, and only change by sign. So minus seven here. Here minus three. So cofactor of matrix. So what is the uh, adjoint? Adjoint of this uh, matrix equal to transpose of cofactor of this matrix. So we take the transpose of uh, this uh, cofactor matrix. So first row two minus seven. Second row. Minus three eleven transpose means convert the row into column. So first row become first column. Second row become second column. So this is the adjoint of this matrix, and therefore LHS equal to what? LHS equal to one upon determinant A. Determinant A is one, so one upon uh, one is one. One upon one into adjoint of this adjoint of this matrix, which equal to this matrix. So this is two minus three minus seven eleven. Which is equal to one upon one, one, one into every number of this matrix is as it is. So two minus three minus seven and last eleven. So this is a NHS. In this uh, manner, we prepare also RHS. Also, we find the RHS. So, RHS equal to B inverse into A inverse. B inverse into A inverse. So, first we find the we find the A inverse and B inverse, and then we take the product of these two inverses with each other. So. For finding A inverse and uh, B inverse, first we use the uh, same method, adjoint method. So by adjoint method, what formula? A inverse equal to one upon determinant A into adjoint of A. And uh, condition is that determinant A is not equal to Zero. So we check the this condition first, and then we find the adjoint of A. So determinant A equal to determinant of determinant of A means uh, this is a given matrix. So determinant of this matrix is a 
बिटवीन टू कॉलम सो टू थ्री फर्स्ट रो टू थ्री सेकंड रो वन टू एंड दिस इज अ सेकंड ऑर्डर डिटर्मिनेंट सो ओनली टेक द क्रॉस मल्टीप्लीकेशन टू इंटू टू फोर माइनस थ्री इंटू वन थ्री फोर माइनस थ्री वन विच इज नॉट इक्वल टू जीरो the one is the one is not equal to zero and therefore determinant a is not equal to zero and therefore a inverse exist a inverse exist again uh, we discuss the how find the inverse of this uh, matrix a by adjoint method so we follow follow the three steps minor of matrix a cofactors of matrix a and the last adjoint of matrix a means a cofactor transpose of cofactors of matrix a so here uh, minor of minor of a equal to minor of a equal to matrix a equal to what minor means determinant obtained by deleting row and the column passing through that number so what is the minor of this number 2 so delete column and the row passing through this number and take the determinant of remaining number so determinant of this 2 itself number 2 again minor of 3 what delete row and column passing through this number 3 so what remaining 1 determinant of 1 is itself 1 again uh, minor of 1 what delete row and column passing through this number 1 so remaining 3 determinant of this 3 itself 3 again uh, minor of this two what delete column and row passing through this number 3 so what remaining only two so determinant of this two itself two so this is our minor of matrix a by using this uh, minor of matrix a we find the cofactors of a cofactors of a what What is the cofactors of a? Use the same idea. No change in the diagonal numbers. Only change in the non-diagonal numbers by sign. Means uh, these two, these two, as it is. Only change in the one, three by sign. Here the plus one, so minus one. Here the plus three become minus three. So this is cofactors of A and therefore, what is adjoint? Adjoint of A equal to what? Transpose of this cofactors of A means uh, transpose of this matrix. Transpose of two minus one, two minus one, as it is minus three two, minus three two. So. what is the meaning of transpose transpose means delete transpose means convert the row into columns convert row into columns so first row become first column so 2 minus 1 second row become second row become second column so Minus three, two. So this is our adjoint, and therefore, by using uh, this uh, formula, a inverse equal to one upon determinant is one, one upon one, one, one into adjoint of a means adjoint of a, and therefore a inverse equal to 
this uh, adjoint of a means uh, this matrix 2 minus 3 minus 1 and 2 similarly we find the determinant of this uh, matrix b determinant of this matrix b because we want to find also b inverse so for uh, finding b inverse also formula same by adjoint method or that one b inverse equal to 1 upon determinant of b into adjoint of a adjoint of b here is the b matrix so adjoint of b so condition is that this uh, determinant of uh, b is not equal to 0 this uh, determinant of b is not equal to 0 so we check this so determinant of b equal to so what is the b this is a matrix b first row 1 0 second row 3 1 so first row 1 0 second row 3 1 so again uh, this is a second order determinant so same idea use we use the idea of cross multiplication so 1 into G, 1 1 minus 0 into 3 0 equal to 1 minus 0 1 and which is not equal to 0 and therefore determinant of b is not equal to 0 and therefore b inverse exist b inverse exist similarly we find the adjoint of uh, b by using uh, adjoint method so again we discuss the three steps minor of matrix cofactors of matrix and transpose of that cofactors of matrix so minor of matrix b equal to again what we discuss direct minor of 1 what row column delete what remaining only 1 so 1 take as it is again this uh, minor of 0 what row column delete so only 3 and uh, minor of 3 means 3 passing a uh, row passing through 3 and the column passing through 3 delete so only remaining 0 again minor of 1 means delete row column passing through this number so remaining only 1 so 1 so this is a minor of b minor of b same we find the cofactors of b cofactors of b so what is the meaning of cofactors cofactor means this is a 2 by 2 matrix so what is the idea no change in the diagonal numbers change the non diagonal numbers by only sign so 1 1 as it is this is a plus 3 become minus 3 and this is a 0 become minus 0 means always 0 so we find the again adjoint of b by using this uh, cofactors we find the adjoint of b so what is the adjoint adjoint is nothing but transpose of this cofactors so equal to transpose of this matrix means uh, 1 minus 3 0 1 so what is the transpose transpose means convert the row into column so first row become first column so 1 minus 3 second row become second column so 0 1 
so this is adjoint of b and therefore a inverse equal to b inverse equal to what what is b inverse by formula b inverse equal to 1 upon determinant b but what is determinant b value of the determinant b is 1 so 1 upon 1 1 1 into adjoint of b adjoint of b and therefore adjoint of b means this uh, matrix so b inverse equal to 1 0 3 1 and uh, so that we uh, find the rhs what is rhs rhs equal to rhs equal to b inverse into a inverse means this is b inverse this is a uh, also a inverse here uh, a inverse here uh, b inverse and we multiply both so b inverse 1 0 minus 3 1 1 0 minus 3 1 into a inverse what is a inverse a inverse first row 2 minus 3 second row minus 1 2 minus 1 2 equal to so we make the multiplication by place to place so first row first column 1 into 2 2 0 1 0 again first row second column what happen 1 into minus 3 minus 3 Zero into two, zero. Again, second row, first column, minus three into two, minus six, plus one into minus one, minus one. Second row, second column, minus three into minus three. Plus nine, one into two, two, so plus two, so this is equal to what? Two plus zero, two minus three plus zero, minus three, minus six minus one, minus seven. And uh, nine plus two, eleven, and this is equal to our LHS. Our LHS. LHS is also two minus three minus seven, eleven, and uh, therefore, and therefore, AB inverse equal to B inverse into A inverse is verified. So this is a true result. So in this manner we discuss. very interesting uh, this problem also we discuss uh, more problems in our next session